Ivan sending you warm greetings from very, very hot Ubud uh, in Bali, Indonesia. Um, I arrived here yesterday after a volcano tour to the Bromo and stuff. That was a great experience. That was the best sunrise I've ever seen. That was just an amazing hike, an amazing tour. You should go watch that video. So yeah, today is my first full day in Ubud. I'm gonna, I'm gonna chill and I'm gonna have good and healthy food because this whole place is full of vegan restaurants. So I'm gonna have some awesome stuff. I'm, I wanna hunt down some um, satay tempeh, which is the best thing in the world. Yeah, I know I'm not looking into the lens. So I need to um, improve that or start only wearing sunglasses in my case instead. Okay, let's go. My friend Tucci is arriving tomorrow on Monday in Ubud. So I'm saving, basically saving all the major sites in Ubud to when she and her other friend gets here so we can explore all of this together. On the Maps Me app, I found that there is a rice field walk very close to my to my house and then i'm gonna go to the cinema i'm gonna watch moonlight to see what it's all about if it's that good i'm gonna keep you posted this is maps me it's a normal offline map so nothing special but wait no yeah but the cool thing is it always has like these free walks in it I'm trying to go and see what this rice field walk has to offer this was also a big help when we went up the, to the volcano and stuff to find uh, the viewpoints and if you're wondering what it's called, it's called Maps Me. Oh, it looks like that. Okay, so I don't know if that's the right way. Probably not. There's no other entrance from the street level. I don't know if I'm just in some private property or not. <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> okay. The security guard found me, so I think I need to go. I think I'm wrong. <laughs> Definitely not the wrong way. Weird. Where is that walk? I found it. There is a really, really weird sign to follow it. Ah, okay. Oh God. Where does this take me to? Okay. <laughs> it's beautiful. Okay, I'm think. Nice little house. The weirdest little path. I think I'm close to the end of it. Look at this. The entrance I took was just on the main street of Ubud and now I walked like two minutes and it is so quiet. for sunrise tomorrow morning. The early bird gets the worm. There's also one more thing I wanted to talk to you about. This afternoon I just watched the documentary from Leonardo DiCaprio which is called Before the Flood and it is fully free, free to watch on YouTube so if you haven't watched it I highly highly recommend watching it. It is so so good and yeah I'd, I don't know. It makes me think about a lot of things. It is an amazing documentary, so please, please go and watch it. Um, especially the astronaut. He was just so positive and so inspiring. Showing the global warming and stuff seen from space. That was so incredible. Just go, please go watch it. If you watched it already, please let me know in the comments if you liked it, 
what was your favorite what's your whole opinion about it um now i'm gonna track down a little snack and then heading to the cinema Sorry if some of you guys has a phobia or something and just I like little little rats, little mice. So cute. So I just came back from the cinema, which was the best cinema I've ever been to. The movie was basically for free. You needed to pay fifty thousand rupiah, but you could use that ticket as a voucher for food and drinks. They call themselves organic vegan cinema, which is the best thing. Food was so good. Movie was Moonlight. Highly recommend. Oscar winning movie. So, so good. Heading to bed because tomorrow is like touristy Monday with the teacher, which means teacher's coming. So excited to see her. She's one of my favorite travel buddies. So yeah, watch out. You'll see her tomorrow. You know that the video is coming up, right? What? Wait one second, can I touch yeah. you because can I touch have... Hi. Hello! <laughs> I found the girls, we're now in the monkey forest! Hi. We tried to get not attacked by the monkeys, so we, we brought oh, no please. food. Yeah. <laughs> so far it's looking good. While you roam in the streets all alone All you can see Thinking about what your life came to be you're a beautiful sight in the summer night. There's a really teeny tiny one. In the How cute is he? What are you going to do with that pack? Trying to live another day Like the mothers of Brazil find their way We're all on our own But you're the most beautiful I've ever known Done with the monkeys! So now we came to the rice terraces But they look very dry I think like rain season is over and you know that's how it looks in not rain season probably. It's a really nice walk through the rice fields, but just the usual overcrowdedness of all the tourists. one of you guys sleeping later on that <laughs> the one that's falling asleep pays the next round of drinks so, okay. oh guys probably gonna, I mean, if I say that it's probably gonna be me who falls asleep we're gonna record <sighs> you can't sleep 
yeah. and it's you can we need see a proof, right? huh we need a proof yeah and you see how shiny i am it is the most humid day ever it's like being in a shower <laughs> Some day was that yesterday I met my friend Tucci again and today I went down to Simignac because uh, my friend Tucci and her friend Gamze are staying down here in Simignac so I wanted to be a bit closer so that we can go on more trips and adventures tomorrow and now I'm gonna go check out the beach which is like 15 minutes by walking and then I'm gonna meet the girls later for dinner until then <laughs> 